semi-finals of the European Cup. If you're old enough, back in 1965-66, they beat them on their way to losing the final against Real Madrid. No such mistakes tonight, though, for Middlesbrough. Nemet's goal on nine minutes. The opener, his first goal since the 25th of August when he scored in a 2-0 away victory against Fulham. And Newcastle, of course, also most famously recently failed to qualify for the Champions League after defeat to Barizan, so they uh, didn't particularly mind a trip up to this side of the country either, but Borough's record in the league this season uh, told a story of what we were likely to expect tonight. 23 minutes gone, the second goal went in. Joseph Desiré Job, second goal of the season, like Nemet as well, and he too hadn't scored since August, his last goal in that rather memorable match at Highbury, where they lost by five goals to three. And Partizan going well enough, of course, in their own lead. They did create chances, unfortunately they couldn't put any of them away. Sasa Ilic, the top scorer for the club this season, with seven goals, should have really done better than that. Well, English teams perhaps got their eye on this competition, they've not won it for a few years now. Good stop that from Kraj. Liverpool, of course, the last side to win this cup back in 2000-2001 with an absolutely incredible night in, uh, against uh, Alaves. Gary McAllister, of course, the big hero on the night. And who's to say this Middlesbrough side aren't capable of going on to secure even better? Radovic there. A little unlucky, perhaps. Fifth in the Premier League, Borough, of course, just four losses. And they've got a pretty tight defence, surprisingly being opened up a bit in the second half, but at 2-0 up, it really didn't matter, did it? Partizan undefeated in 15 games in their own league, but this is a whole different quality of game. Schwartz are producing the save of the night. Tomic has crossed Zazulic once again. And they've got a great record in terms of scoring goals as well. The 125th match for Parizan. And uh, that was the miss of the night. Naj firing over the bar. Finding it difficult to do, Parizan, what they've found is historically rather easy scoring goals in this competition. Third and final goal for Middlesbrough. James Morrison, the attacking midfielder, another fine young talent. It's not all about Danny at this club. First goal came in the UEFA Cup, first round, second leg at Banik Ostrava. His first senior start, the player born in Darling to do, made his league debut. It would made his debut in the league in uh, January of 2004 against Knox County, and a night to remember here for him. Well, Middlesbrough were entitled to take their foot off the gas and just leave a few spaces. At the end, it's been a very successful campaign indeed, perhaps more than they expected. Another victory for the Borough.